subscribe. Click on the bell. Like, comment, share. The uses of electrolysis in industry. Have you ever wondered, from this simple experiment, wonderful things can happen to us? These jewelry, silverware, food canning, and these beautiful car accessories are product of electrolysis. And metals used for these industries are also extracted and purified using the process of electrolysis. At the end of this lesson, you should be able to state the uses of electrolysis in industries, explain the extraction of metals involving electrolysis in industries, write chemical equations to represent the electrolysis process in industries. Click on the next button to continue. The uses of electrolysis in industry Various substances are prepared commercially by electrolysis, for example, in electroplating industries, less expensive metals are given a coating of silver or gold. Some reactive metals can only be extracted through electrolysis and undergo electro-refining process which is also applying the process of electrolysis. Extraction of metals Mineral is a solid element or compound which occurs naturally in the earth crust. A mineral which contains a high percentage of a metal for economic extraction is called a metal ore. The method used to extract a metal from its ore depends on the position of the metal in the reactivity series. Metal below carbon in the reactivity series like zinc, silver and copper are extracted from its ore by heating with carbon. A metal above carbon in the reactivity series like aluminium and magnesium are extracted by electrolysis. This is bauxite. Bauxite contains aluminium oxide. Aluminium can be extracted from bauxite through electrolysis. Let's take a look at how aluminium is extracted from its ore. First, the cell. The electrolysis is carried out in a large steel vessel, maybe up to 8 meter long, 4 meter wide and about 1 meter depth. This vessel is lined up with graphite cathode and array of suspended carbon anodes. A typical production facility may contain as many as 400 such cells. Click one for more information. Pure aluminium oxide is not used for electrolysis because of aluminium oxide has high melting point. To lower the melting point, cryolite is added to the vessel. Now, click 2. As the electric current flows, aluminium ions move towards the cathode and gain 3 electrons each to become aluminium atoms. Molten aluminium formed by the electrolysis collects at the bottom of the vessel. Can you key in the half equation at the cathode? Now, click on 3. At the anode, the oxide ions attracted to the anode and lose 2 electrons each to form oxygen molecules. The oxygen gas then reacts with the carbon anode to produce carbon dioxide gas. The carbon anodes become smaller and have to be replaced after 20 days. Can you key in the half equation at the anode? Click on the next button to continue. At the end of this lesson, you have learned that electrolysis is useful in industry for the extraction of metals, the purification of metals, electroplating. The method used to extract metal from its ore depends on the position of the metal in the reactivity series. A metal below carbon in the reactivity series extracted from its ore by heating with carbon. 
a metal above carbon in the reactivity series may be extracted by electrolysis. In electrolysis of aluminum oxide, at the anode, oxide ions lose electron and produce oxygen molecule. At the cathode, aluminum ions gain electrons and aluminum atom is produced. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon.